In 2011 and 12, CSU experienced a year filled with advancements, celebrations, breakthroughs, achievements, and growth. Enrollment grew to record levels as the year kicked off with the annual RAM Welcome. Homecoming Week, we engaged alumni and friends with our traditional homecoming events. They saw for themselves why our student recreation facilities received a national award for the most outstanding sports facilities. Just west of the award-winning rec center, fans were treated to some rafter-shaking Moby Madness, starting with the volleyball team's win over highly ranked Nebraska, through a magical men's basketball season which earned the Rams a trip to the NCAA tournament. The cheering continued as the campaign for Colorado State reached its $500 million goal six months early to provide hundreds of new scholarships, several dozen new endowed chairs, and 42 new or renovated facilities on campus. And you are the reason that it remains my very great honor to serve as the president of your university. Thank you very much. Support and vision changed the landscape of our campus with continued expansions and upgrades to classroom and learning facilities for agriculture students, a new undergraduate housing facility for 600 students, renovation of the 50-year-old Lori Student Center, and the Engineering 2 project. The innovative partnership with Intu, an international student recruitment venture, launched a long-term initiative to boost diversity and international presence on campus. Coca-Cola partnered with CSU to focus on global water issues by launching the new CSU Coca-Cola Water Scholars Program. Chairman and CEO of the Coca-Cola company, Mutar Kent, came to campus to speak about shared values for a sustainable future. Sharing CSU's innovations with the world remains a focus for Colorado's land-grant university. Research on a global level continues through the School of Global Environmental Sustainability, directed by Diana Wall. Also, after three decades, CSU scientists have made an extraordinary discovery in tuberculosis research. They now know what protects the bacterium that causes tuberculosis, which could lead to breakthroughs in treatment of the disease. Despite a down economy, annual research spending increased nearly 10% to more than $330 million, a record high for CSU. This year brings impressive recognitions. Animal science professor and autism trailblazer Temple Grandin is inducted into the Colorado Women's Hall of Fame. The American Physical Science Society awarded Jorge Roca the 2011 Arthur L. Shalo Prize in Laser Science, one of the highest honors for a physicist. Carolyn Luger was honored once again with the Howard Hughes Medical Institute Investigator Award. New appointments and faces solidify CSU's commitment to greatness. Dr. Mark Stetter was named Dean of CSU's College of Veterinary Medicine and Biomedical Sciences. Stetter joined CSU from the Walt Disney Company, where he was the director of animal programs worldwide. An alumnus, business well, leader, and former Rams quarterback, not. Jack Graham, was hired as the it's university's new not. athletic director. And Jim McElwain, the offensive coordinator and quarterback coach for the University of Alabama, was named the Rams right. head football coach. Larry Eustachy okay. takes over the helm of our rising men's basketball program, and we introduced Ryan Williams to head up our women's basketball program. At CSU's Animal Cancer Center, it's a retirement celebration of Dr. Stephen Withrow's spectacular career. More than 600 of Withrow's friends and colleagues came to our South Campus to send off into retirement the legendary oncologist and founder of the Animal Cancer Center. Thanks to Steve's leadership and legacy, the Animal Cancer Center has a firm foundation to move forward and achieve new heights as a world-class cancer center, leading in teaching, service, and research. Through a rare combination of passion and pragmatism, inspiration and impact, the CSU community was engaged in the transformative work of improving lives through innovative programs and opportunities such as the opening of our new STEM Center, student-run TEDxCSU, advocacy group celebrations, the veteran-focused Yellow Ribbon Program, Commitment to Veterans, On the Oval, Planting Trees for Arbor Day, and so much more.
It adds up to another spectacular year as our land-grant university lives out its mission, committed to the people of Colorado, the nation, and the world.